Hello everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Inside A Gamer. Welcome back to American Truck Simulator. Welcome to the VTC with Simply Connect and uh, welcome to a new truck in the company. Obviously the uh, first of the month I have allowed us to have a second base. Um, so anyone that's following the VTC, we now have a second base, which means I did allow a new truck. And obviously with the trucks that have just been released yesterday, the Freightliner, uh, I thought, why not? We, we should buy that really, shouldn't we? So that's exactly what we've done. Uh, so what we have here in front of us is the Freightliner Cascadia. Um, but hello to everyone in the chat. Spaghetti Raver, hello, hello, hello. Uh, Artful, hello. Uh, Curtis Hard, I assume you're there. Yeah, you are there. Richard, hello, mate. Hello, hello, hello. Um, so look, we've got a few things to do to start with. We're going to go to a garage because the brand new cabin accessories uh, was released at 7 o'clock this evening. Um, so we're going to look at that as well. Get this thing out of my face. Um, so what we're going to do is go to the garage and we're going to have a little look and have a little bit of a nose uh, with the truck. And then we're going to go off and do a couple of runs for the company. What I plan to do today, though, is take a drive uh, with the trailer. I think the trailer is attached. We'll find out in a second. Uh, Steg79. Hello, mate. Hello. Welcome. Welcome. Uh, so look, one thing that American Truck has lacked is an accessories pack. Um, so I'm actually quite excited for this. Do I have the trailer on the back? No, I do not. Well, let's pick that up then before we do anything else. Um, because I do want to take the trailer with us today. There it is. So we're going to do some runs with the trailer today. Make a little bit more money because uh, that cost me a fortune to get a new truck. Uh, we have a truck up north now doing nothing in Eugene. So, uh, yeah, perfect timing to get some new stuff. But here we go. Here is the freight lineup. It's looking quite nice. Uh, I must admit, I do have the sat-nav version here in the front. Um, the dash is quite nice. The mirrors are a bit awkward. It's kind of one of these trucks you can't quite see from these mirrors, but these bonnet mirrors are a pile of crap as well. Look at them. You can barely see out of them. Uh, <laughs> so mirrors are a thing. Might have to drive with virtual mirrors. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. Look. Let's turn her on. She's pairing nicely. Have a little look on the outside. So we've only got the day cab because that's all we're allowed in the company to start with. Um, wh whatever truck we buy. Um, but it's looking pretty good. It's kind of got a... It's kind of a cross between like a Mac and a Peterbilt. Um, but it's nice to have a new truck. It's like having a new toy. So we've got small fuel trade uh, tanks on us again. So we're going to be fueling a lot today. And we are going to take our own uh, trailer around. Do a couple of deliveries and uh, see where we go. Who uses their mirrors anyways? <laughs> well, it's true, but it's just it's just uh, oh, it's just annoying. Okay, on the map, I have no idea where the garage is, so that does not help. Uh, out to the left. I should have known that. Daylight running lights on, of course. Let me know if the volume's okay, guys. So like I said, can't see a bloody thing uh, with the mirrors. It is what it is. She's a bit sluggish. I don't know what she's going to be like under load. Uh, she doesn't have the most powerful engine. Uh, that's for sure. And the brakes are ridiculous. What the hell's going on with them? We may have to look at the sensitivity issues on the brakes for this truck. Uh, but first things first, into the garage. A little bit awkward that I've actually got the trailer with us. But anyways. So what we're going to do first today is we're going to look at the new cabin accessories pack. Oh my god, the brakes are nuts. What the hell? <clears throat> okay, so let's go look into the truck configuration. So just so you guys know, look, I have all the basics. We've only got 370 horsepower here. Uh, it's not great, to be honest with you. Uh, definitely. Do this. These will probably be my first upgrades next month. I think we're going to do some work on this. Um, but anyways, what we actually want to look at today is the cabin. Now, I haven't put anything in here yet, uh, mainly because I wanted to check this pack out. Let's put my boss sign back in. So look, we've got loads of new stuff. Look at this. This is pretty cool. Donuts, goalkeeper masks, um, baseballs, not as much as I was actually hoping for, but something, I suppose. What can we throw up here? Oh, that's for the windshield. Those are those wing mirrors that are absolutely useless. There we go. Proper American. 
<laughs> I knew Americans would go around with American flag hats. Oh, I could put my aviators there. What about an ATS mug? We're going to put the one thing there. Oh, we've got some of these smelly things. I like the bumblebee. <laughs> What else we got? Can we put a dog on the seat? No, but we got some delivery reports. That's pretty cool. <laughs> the American truck game. Uh, breakfast cereals. Uh, we, we won't know what they're for, will we? Lunchbox. Got some bags. Oh, I can watch a movie while driving. We could do that. We could do that. Uh, but you know what? I actually I quite like uh, the delivery logs. I think they look pretty cool. And we've only got the day cab at the moment, so there's not loads that we can do with this. Uh, no, we can't customize any of that stuff. Naughty. Uh, okay, we've got some things up here, maybe. Oh, we got some of those crappy things. Yeah, not as much as I was actually hoping for. Oh, look, we've got a portable navigator. Definitely needed one of them, but I think we'll put the cell phone in there in the front. Uh... We can change the steering wheel, but I actually kind of like the default steering wheel on this. So look, this accessories pack's pretty cool. There's a few new things for us. What the hell's that? Makes it into a two cup holder. And we can now put a cup in it. Bit of cola. That'd be more me. My coffee can. There we go. This has cost me two grand. <laughs> what the hell's happened here? Where did all this money come from? Maybe we'll go for the American football. I do like a bit of American football. There we go. There's some of the little the the uh, not a gun rack. <laughs> yeah, there's a uh, some of the accessory packs. Look, it's pretty cool. It's about time the ATS got a bit of love with that. So look, I'll take that. Oh, and our cell phone gives us the sat nav up the front there too as well, uh, which is nice. So we got double sat nav, guys. Just in case we miss one. Richard, that's what you need, isn't it? <laughs> Okay, guys, so look, let's go into the fright market. Let's have a look what we got. What can we pull today? Uh, we're back in Las Vegas because uh, the game, I was in Oxnard, uh, but for some reason the game has thrown me back to Las Vegas because of the update, uh, which is fine. The other truck is up here in Eugene. Uh, like I said before, we are going to let you guys get workers eventually, uh, but we'll talk about that another day. So what we're going to do now is take some cargo. Let, let's do a few little runs this evening. Um, Obviously, we want to go further than Las Vegas to Las Vegas. What have we got here? Use recycling. Paying very well. They're saying that I don't really know what the truck can handle, which doesn't help either. Um, goes to Los Angeles. Ooh, household appliances. I feel like we should go into Arizona and make our way up to Colorado, maybe, and into Utah. Uh, we were going north, but... That's now a little bit of a change of plan, but we can switch between our trucks now. We go to the Grand Canyon. It's quite far. We can close again. I want to try and take something from Walbert. We go to the home stores. You know what? Let's go to Utah. Infusion, hey guys, new truck's looking sharp. It is looking good, mate. Well done for the paintwork as always. Uh, well done for getting it done so fast as well. I think I'm the only one that's brought the truck so far in the company. I don't know, has anyone else, any of the other guys in the VTC, have you brought this yet? Like I said, my only, my only problem with it is one, the brakes need looking at, but two, the mirrors are a little bit, oh, that's not too bad actually. If I have it there, can just see enough. Okay, let's go and Go pick up a load and head up to Utah today. Because I'm late, just received my Ryzen 2 600 day. Oh, well, awesome, mate. You'll be gaming with us in no time. Is it a DLC place? It is not a DLC place. Try to make the most money price per distance. Adrian Martinez, yeah. Um, not too worried about it too much. Uh, we've got pretty good money in the company. Um, just want to kind of make not too long, long runs per stream, but you know, kind of mix them up a little bit. 
uh, going into different states. So look, we're going to Utah today. Like I said we were going up to Washington, uh, but the update in the new truck, obviously, uh, there was only three places you can buy the truck. Uh, Utah, California, and I can't remember which one was the other one. Uh, I am remaking my whole PC tomorrow. Oh, nice. Good luck with that. I did that this week and it was a headache. My computer is only just running right now. <laughs> Not brought the second truck yet. The starter Mac and the 505 HP engine just throw a 500 engine in that Freightliner. Uh, no stake, you know the rules. <laughs> you know the rules. So look, if anyone does want to come join our VTC and join the company, you are more than welcome. Simply connect. Like it's like now, I can't even see enough to indicate over. Whoa, where did he come from? Cut up the other car, lovely. Yeah, the engine in this is not great. It kind of re does remind me of the Peter Peter build a little bit. It is a little bit naff on that front, that's for sure. Hopefully our trailer is going to fit in here to load. Oh, uh, we're going to be pretty stuffed. <laughs> yes, Dave, I'm watching you. I've just shown everybody that I brought the cheap, cheap one. Wow, the brakes are just harsh as anything. That's like that in real life. I would not want to drive this truck. Okay, cargo market. Uh, not worth. It's actually worth pretty decent money. Like stuff. Arizona. You know, I, I'm actually quite happy to go up to Utah, and then we'll go into Colorado and back round. That might be our new route. Uh, first like. <laughs> don't have many likes. I don't know. I can't. I haven't seen the other screen to be honest with you. Okay, let's try and park this bad boy. I haven't actually parked this trailer yet. first time. That was a terrible reverse by myself. Boo. They're going to be looking at this thinking what Muppet is taking this cargo. <laughs> Jesus guys, that was terrible. Make an absolute hash of this. practice for sure <laughs> uh, just tell them it's your first day yeah I feel like it's my first day this is like the worst parking I've ever done we'll take that <laughs> but we're in nice truck it is a nice truck Richard Simhub uh, how did you get the speedo in the bottom left corner uh, I've used it using OBS, uh, so basically uh, I've just used it as a, what you call it? Okay. Get ourselves out of here, out of this absolute disaster. It's quite a long trailer for that little parking. Probably should have looked at, hopefully it was the other Woolworths. Uh, 
I will get back to chat now in just two seconds. Uh, okay, <laughs> okay, I'll just keep mine on the second screen. Yeah, so basically, I can't actually see that on my screen. That's not on my screen, mate. I'm just using the, uh, the HTTP link and using it for OBS so you guys can see it. I actually can't see... Uh, it, it is on a second screen, but I have you guys in the chat up, so I can't really see it. Yeah, this truck has no power with the engine that we've taken today. <coughs> when you're a new license holder, you watch every other driver watch you and never help normal stuff. <laughs> yeah. Turn FFB off. What is FFB? Oh, I don't mind parking. Normally I park a lot better than that. That, that was dreadful. I went in at the wrong angles. Ten thousand uh, revs until we get to five gears. Here we go. Any of you guys in the company that decide to pick up this truck this month, good luck to you. Until it gets upgraded, it's going to be—it's uh, not going to be able to pull much. Uh, the Mac is definitely so much better. Out of the box. Turn off force feedback. Force feedback is off mostly. I like it a little bit. I don't like it completely off. I have it turned down uh, a hell of a lot. Obviously, when I'm turning like that, it's probably all you guys could hear. Have you equipped the boss's skin with logos? Can't quite see watching on my phone. Uh, yes, I do have the boss's skin on. Uh, I do have the logos and stuff. Let's see, I'll show you if you want to see them. But yeah, the truck is looking really nice, mate. You've done an awesome job as always painting our trucks. Here we go. Simply connect. Can't drive it while doing this, but there you go. Just so you can see, I, I do have the boss's logos on. Nice little sticker down there too. David, are you running a graphics mod? Uh, yes, there are some graphics enhancement mods on here, yes. Not too many though, I'm only using one. Uh, it's the one that I've used for a long, long time. It's like the scenery graphics one. Um, I can leave a list of these. If anyone wants them, I can get a list of them together. I found the brakes better on the Volvo. I found the Mac brakes quite poor. Yeah, I'd rather poor brakes than brakes like this. The brakes on this truck are like monsters. <laughs> it's an absolute joke. I barely actually put my foot on the pedal and it's going to a halt. And I have my sensitivity down all the way. Uh, I'm thinking transmission for next upgrade. Can I live with the Mac engine but for heavier stuff? I think it needs more gears. Yeah. God, it's so hard to drive and talk, guys. Um, yeah, for me, my next upgrade, I think I'm going to upgrade this one. Um, I'm quite happy with the Mac. My Mac pulls okay. I must admit, I did go up a hill in uh, California. I don't know which hill I was. Just before Oxnard. And yeah, I was maybe doing 20, 20 miles an hour all the way up. It was pretty bad. I must admit, it, it, it was pretty bad. It's a nice truck to fight liner, but yeah, it doesn't have the oomph that the Mac has, that's for sure. Uh, how do I get this livery? Adrian Martinez, this is my virtual trucking company. We work all through Trucksbook. Most of the people in the chat there actually work for me. Um, so we actually have a full-on company. So this is a company, uh, and this... Hang on, I just... Here we go, so if I just bring up the photo studio, it'd be easier. So here we go, just so we can take a look at the livery nicely. Um, we need to get one shot for the Discord anyways, look at that. Boom. So obviously this is my YouTube channel. Uh, we work at Simply Connect Haulage, Las Vegas. That is our dot numbers and stuff. Uh, Simply Connect, here you go, here's our logo. We actually have companies in planes, buses, and trucks. I have a Simply Connect uh, business and virtual companies in flights, sims. I like that. Uh, flight sims, truck sims, and uh, OMSI bus sims as well. So if you want to come join the company, you're more than welcome. And that's how you'll get hold of delivery. Um, but yeah, that's the only way I'm handing out deliveries at the moment. You have to come join the, the company. He 
He's also completely maxed out the game with 400% scaling too. Yes, my game is maxed to the max. Uh, what was the key to go outside again? Uh, number two. Number two on your on your keyboard. Uh, steady chip. Nice wheels. Hello, mate. Welcome. Going to come join our ATS virtual company? Here she is. Look at, Look at this bad boy. Looking good. Uh, so for anyone that might be interested that is there in the chat so basically how it works you come join the discord uh the repaints are in the discord and uh, i send you a profile so we are playing a little bit of role play in this like you have to have standard truck sense why we're only taking the day cab uh, Frightliner out today and every month i allow upgrades to trucks we just upgraded most of us just upgraded the mac because most of us took the mac profile um we do run this through trucks book so you will have to use trucks book if you want to come drive with us and it's a bit of fun I'll move the SH logo back a bit. The hood mirrors will send. Yeah, yeah, that was the only thing for this one. But the hood mirrors, to be honest with you, I might take them off because they're a pile of crap. Uh, I've never known a hood mirror to be so bad. But you can't quite see out the other mirrors either, so it was a kind of a catch-22. Uh, I'm focused on flying for now. <laughs> yeah, no worries, mate. Well, look, you're more than welcome to come join our flying company too. Simply connect. We did do a flight last night. It was very interesting. Well, one of the flights was very interesting. We are heading up to Utah. I actually like Utah. It's probably one of my favorite DLCs. Uh, I do love the landscape. But yeah, I, I do have this game now maxed out thanks to my lovely upgrade. Thanks to Kurt is hard. Woohoo. Going way too fast for that corner. Um, yeah, everything is maxed out. And I think I have like 500 frames a second. <laughs> Even on max, max, max. Like, it's pretty nuts. So hopefully it looks kind of nicer for you guys. I know I'm still streaming in 720, but that's because of lockdown. I know we're just easing out of lockdown, but it's going to take a little bit of time still uh, before that's all sorted. But yeah, hopefully it looks... Does it look better? Do you guys... Can you guys sense a difference? Look at the rocks. Like, do they look nice? Oh, Jesus. Can't get up the hill. Come on. Uh, Zeno. Hello, mate. Oi, oi. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Haven't seen you in a while. To max my machine a little. <laughs> yeah, look, my upgrade was probably a little bit overkill for right now, but... We can all thank Kurt as hard. He is, uh, he's contributed to the channel, shall we say. Yeah, hopefully it looks a little bit nicer, a little bit, you know, more detailed. A little bit of rendering going on there, taking a little bit of time, but... I don't have MSI Afterburner on. I know that uh, Edis wanted me to show my frames. I'm keen on those graphic mods. Yeah, I, I, look, anyone that wants to know the mods that I am using, uh, for sure, in the Discord after this, I will link every single one of them um, off the top of my head. Look, these are ones that I've just used for a long time, so, you know, you guys probably know better ones than me. Ah. Uh. Yes, okay, I get it. You want us to pull in. No problem. So, let's go in and get weighed. Shame I can't get any fuel here. Would have just filled up for the sake of pulling in. Have a safe journey, guys. <laughs> yeah, so look, I, I run a couple of graphic mods that make it, like, the vegetation just look a little bit better. Uh, the roads, they look a little bit better, I believe. Is this your RTX upgrade PC? Yes. This is my... My upgrade. But yeah, the graphics are uh, definitely boosted now with all the, the extra power that we have. I didn't upgrade RTX. NVIDIA. I uh, got a mod like these things ahead and not bad. Yeah, look, there, there, there's loads of mods out there, but some of them don't always work. Okay, we've discovered St. George. Nice. I heard you were speeding. Sham on you. <laughs> I haven't been speeding at all. This truck can't speed, it can't go bloody fast enough. 
new fight line. Unfortunately, it's a bit slow on the on the basic guys. So any of you thinking that you're gonna buy this this month? I mean, look at this. We're getting we're getting shot by Kenworth. Probably carrying ten times the amount of crap that I am too. Look, we'll just put the cruise control on. Go a bit faster, but look, real mileage. We need the real mileage for the company. Yeah, NVIDIA. Uh, no engine mods. As in what, my sounds? No. No bog standard. I think your driver needs to go to the gym. What driver? Okay, so there you go, there's the first delivery already. Welcome to Utah, boys and girls. I do like Utah. It's kind of nice to take the company trailer out for a change. And I said the last time I took other people's jobs, it's kind of nice to pick up our own cargoes. Worth a little bit more money as well. It's an RTX. Oh, it's RTX. What am I on about? What an idiot. I've already forgotten. It's because I'm reading and driving. I can't... My, my brain... I can't even think of the right words. People want to see the new livery on the new truck, so speed doesn't count. <laughs> I wouldn't say speeding was the issue. The issue was uh, driving in a straight bloody line. I do like the logo on the back. I must admit. But the trucks, the lines, they look awesome as always. Yeah, that logo... Well, I'm going to take off those, um, those bloody things at the front, the wing mirrors, anyways. I said I can't even see out of them. How to join the company. Adrian Martinez, are you on my Discord? Uh, am I putting in here? No. But yeah, you are more than welcome to come join us, uh, Martinez. We have about 20 drivers currently, and quite a few streamers are streaming with uh, this company, uh, which is lovely. Like I said, we do have a few rules. Um, uh, we've got a little bit of roleplay elements to it, kind of thing. Um, yeah, look, if, if you're willing to, to stick by all of them, you are more than welcome. Okay, where do they need it? Go on, why not? Let's just do it properly. Uh, no. Okay, uh, Adrian, the best thing to do is join the Discord. Uh, if you then take up a trucker role and a friends role, you'll see the um, the categories for the VTCs, and you'll see the haulage one, which is this one. Um, and most of the details are in there, and most of the guys here can help you set up. Um, it's fairly simple. You just put the paints and the mods. I give you a profile. Basically, you pick your starter truck. So to start with, you can have a Mac, a Kenworth. Oh, it's going to be this crap again. Take it all the way around. The Mac, the Kenworth, or the Volvo. They are the starting trucks that we have. No. And uh, basically, I send you the profile. And you work off my profile. You'll have a company credit card. Uh, with 250,000 on, um, so you'll use that for your first bases. You're only allowed to buy other locations once I permit it, uh, which we are allowed to buy one at the moment, so you would be allowed to do that if you wished. I don't know why it's going so bloody wide. Um, and you are currently allowed to buy your second truck if you wished as well. You don't need to. You can only have the standard day cabs until... Uh, until the first of the month where you'll put in for an upgrade and I'll allow certain upgrades etc and you only allow one upgrade per truck so if you have more than one truck you can only upgrade one truck at a time okay handbrake on engine off it's going to take a few minutes there we go welcome tableware to Vegas to St. George nice little bit of money in the bank Perfect. Okay, uh, so we see what else we have on the cargo market. 
I'll stream a little bit. Yeah, you're more than welcome. So basically, the one thing, I don't have any rules on that. Anyone is allowed to stream, uh, do as they wish with it. Um, you know, the only thing I, I ask is that you link the Discord if you're going to promote it, etc. Anyone is allowed to join. Uh, that kind of that kind of stuff. Basically, we don't have a lot of choice here. Uh, oh, Jesus. Not going all the way up there. I don't want to go back to Vegas either. I could go to Page, Arizona. That wasn't my idea. That's the only problem with these cargoes instead of actually making my own cargoes. Uh, you know what? I'm going to ditch the company trailer, guys. Yeah, let's ditch the trailer. Um... Okay, so the trailer's gone back. Um, so I'm going to be back in two seconds. I'm just going to create myself a job on Trucks Book. Uh, we don't have to leave the screen. Just give me two seconds. I'm just going to create myself a job. And I actually forgot to even put Trucks Book open that time, so I didn't even record that bloody job, did it? What an idiot. Yeah, just a couple of seconds. I'm just assigning myself a job. That's all I'm doing. And we are in Utah. St. George. Go over to Walbert. There's not much here. We'll go up to Mobe in Utah. Perfect. Okay, just got to close the simulator for two seconds. There we go, we are back with the game. Perfect, okay, go to the job market now. Uh, we should have... Where are we going? We're going to Mobe. I don't even know where we're going. Going pretty damn far. Okay, uh, we're taking cans to Mobe. That's our next job. Pretty long one. Well, I hope you feel better soon, mate. I hope you get better soon. Okay, the fight liner was playing games with me. <laughs> okay, so we're going to take our delivery of cans up to Mo. Pretty long drive, this one. Be worse places to be for two weeks. It'll be a struggle, but I really hope I can recover in a few days. Yeah, look, it affects everybody differently. Um, 
Hopefully you'll be okay. Hopefully it doesn't come too 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 rough. But it's probably better to get it than not to get it in my eyes as well. You know, you're young, you're fit, you're healthy. It's probably uh, you know. Hopefully you do gain some sort of antibodies, who knows? And the science is pretty core cool and all that stuff at the moment. Manage a few runs with the own trailer, but more choice without it. Yeah, that's the only problem, Steg. Like, it was just nothing was going anywhere I wanted to go. Um, so yeah, back to uh, making my own. I don't mind turning off the game and uh, creating my own loads, because it's parts of the map that I want to go to, so it doesn't bother me too much. In fact, once I get it, I'll probably be immune to it. You don't know exactly, mate. And, you know, that that's that's all we can kind of hope for with that kind of stuff, isn't it? Uh, ooh, what the bloody hell's going on here? Smoke time, no worries, mate. Yeah, mate, I live in Auckland. Napier. When Bixley got hit by the flood, it was his yearly bath time. He left it running. Bloody going to pick up this load. Too far. At the moment, I only have a sniff. Yeah, I mean, look, it affects. There's been some people who have had it and they've literally had nothing. There's others, obviously, that get a lot, lot worse. Like I said, the, the thing you have on your side is your youth. Uh, so you should be okay. Hopefully, fingers crossed for you, mate. Okay, hopefully our job is still hit. Form cans. 10 grand. It's alright. I believe that is my trailer. Ooh, ice cream van. It's a really awkward one, look. Our number one contract is with Walbert, so, you know, we've got to do a bit of work for them. Off we go. I still think I prefer my Mac. I still think the Mac is a, a nicer truck. My son tested positive, no symptoms. Oh, Jesus, reading the bloody chat again. Yeah, it, it's, a, it's a strange one, isn't it? How it affects some so much harder than others. But the main thing is testing now. At least people can get tested. I mean, I'm a frontline worker, so here, when the testing was, well, the testing is still poor here. But, you know, I get a test literally within 24 hours because of my job. So, that's the only good thing. 
you know, just rest up, take things easy, you know. How are we doing for fuel? Got plenty of fuel. But I think we'll hold out for a while on the fuel front. Well, I'm self-isolating day 4 of 14. Oh, nice. I feel like I've been isolating for most of the year since the car crash. Um, obviously just been at home, so... Can't drive anyway, so... I feel like I've been isolating for, like, months. Anyways, mate. Yeah, Glenn Bixley, he's, he's the official painter. He's the one that's doing our planes and our trucks for us at the moment. He's uh, awesome, been doing a great job. Pulling out the mileage too. Between you and Jesse, the mileage is uh, it's getting close. I got tested twice, both negative. Yeah, to be funny, uh, when I got tested, I, I don't like the uh, thing down the nose. It was pretty rough. I don't like that kind of thing anyways. Nothing should go down your nose. I mean, if COVID... What, that, what gets me is, if COVID was so contagious, like they said, how would a saliva sample not be good enough? Why did it have to go to the back of the throat through the nose? Like, it makes no sense to me. I feel like, you know, it's just a bit of fun on their point. Ah, you know, it's not very pleasant. We'll, we'll, we'll do it to them. Obviously, there's a reason for it, but yeah. <laughs> uh, well, one perk of staying in my room for two weeks is more time for watching you. Oh, cheers, mate. Well, I'm sure you can do some work on your own channel as well. Uh, Glenn, sorry, uh, uh, Living Fusion is the, uh, the painter. We have it all, all the owe to him for these lovely trucks. I did my own test. And then you know your limits. <laughs> yeah, let's take the inside lane. Oh, it's an exit. What I hate about American roads, there's too much of these, you know, in our roads we wouldn't sit in the middle lane, like, uh, but here's different, I suppose it's kind of like French roads actually, French roads are very much like this as well. Uh, Artful, what happened today in your end of the woods? There's a huge explosion and missing people and everything, what, what the hell happened? I'm used to putting a thing up my nose. What the hell do you put up your nose, your finger? <laughs> I got off pizza to watch you. <laughs> what? Drive like a tit. Cheers, mate. Much appreciated. It's always much appreciated, everyone hanging out and being around. But Ice, you need to get driving. You're slacking. Even you, Richard. Where have you been? You were doing so well the other day. You need to get some longer journeys under your belt. I have no idea. knew nothing about it until you mentioned it earlier. All right. I thought it was big news, it was like all over the place here. Oh Jesus, four dead. Yeah, they, they didn't really release much details. It was a, it was a huge um, news flash, but they didn't tell us what, what was actually going on. They just said there was a huge explosion and there were people missing. No, when I went to have my operation in March, I was breathing thing and the wires on those are, ah, yeah, that's nasty. Come on, truck. We're going uphill, guys, and it is struggling. I know I'm on cruise control, but even now it's struggling. I'm playing the aisles, being a dinosaur. Yeah, I know. I saw. I saw in your Discord. I was wondering, what is it? It's like a multiplayer dinosaur hunting game or something, isn't it? Yeah, let's take off the cruise control. We need to put our foot down here. I think the fuel tanks on this is actually better than the Mac. I think, I don't know what size the fuel capacity is, but the standard is definitely a lot better. Normally by now I'd have to re uh, refuel the fuel times. Okay, Cedar City, welcome, welcome. Festival City, USA. Had a few bad MS days, needed to rest. Oh, Jesus, can't read and do this. 
But hopefully in a day or so I'll get back. Oh, no worries, mate. No worries, mate. Look, health is obviously more important. I'm only messing. I'm only messing. I, I don't mind when you guys drive or if you drive. What do you have to do? Just hunt dinosaurs? Is that the thing? And the reason why I had one of those things is because I had a problem with my lung. So they had to do something to it. Well, I'm glad you understood what they did to you. <laughs> what was wrong with your lung? No, look, hopefully you're okay. Hopefully, the, you know, the main thing, everyone's okay. Back on the old cruise control here. Plus, I've been working on the ARC server as well. What are you doing with ARC? I've never really played ARC. Start as a baby, then within five hours, if you can make it that long, you become an adult. I'm glad you fully recovered, mate. It's in early, early access. I think I saw it on Keymail, though. Could apply for it, maybe. Just stopped working, kind of since I had never drank any food or water. Oh, Jesus. That's rough, mate. Ark is a dino survival game, where you have to survive in the land of dinos. <laughs> yeah, I know what Ark is, um, but I've never played it. But what do you do on a server? Like, do you have people that like live on your map or something? Friggin' how I was reading bloody chat. Oh, they're not even letting us up here. Uh, well, I don't want to take the long way around, so I'm actually going to ignore them today. I'm sure it's not that bad up here. I think they're just having a bit of fun with us. Um, I'm actually driving under the speed limit, uh, C.D. Jones's. Uh, ooh, this is not so good um, because because I'm driving on trucks book we have to drive under 62 miles an hour so I'm actually not even speeding but I suppose that if you refer into real life um, yeah we'll ignore this accident that would have taken me on a huge trip round we, we didn't want to do that are we getting tired yet? I haven't even looked oh. no we're doing okay We'll be at a destination soon. Uh, Highland Homestead. I want... If I only want to have the base game map for America Truck Simulator, is it still worth getting? Yeah, it actually comes with a couple of maps. You get California, Nevada. Um, to be honest with you, if you if you look on the key sites now, you can pick up like New Mexico for £2. Like the DLCs, some of them are very cheap, and I think it's worth it. And you can come join the company Highland Homestead, uh, even with the base. You don't have to have all the maps to, to join the company, so... Yeah, I think so. I think some people are right now. I'm, I'm trying to see... Uh, that... Uh, Bonagani, American Truck Simulator, new Freightliner Cascader. Yes, that's exactly what we're driving this evening, the brand new Cascader. 
Uh, it's nice. It's not very powerful, but look, uh, because of the role play that we have with the company, we've only got the basic, basic um, engines, chassis, transmission, um, because obviously we have to upgrade that over time, so yeah. Arc is how bad can software run on good hardware simulator. It excels at being an unpolished turd. <laughs> I thought people always kind of raved about Arc. <laughs> I like Arc, but the building is bad and the game is very hard. Yeah, but you like, you like those kind of survival games, don't you? But I'm not driving very well. The chat's kind of going off and I'm trying to read, but... Uh... Oh no, I'm going over my mileage. No! Okay, back on the old cruise control here. All right. Yes, compared to real life, oh yeah, so <laughs> yeah. It's nice though. How long would that be in real life? How long would that take? A couple of hours, I'd say, wouldn't it? Uh, okay, so I don't have any problems with ARC and I'm on a medium spec PC. Uh, yeah, Highland Homestead, yeah, I, I think it's a good little pickup. And like I said, if you want to come join the company, uh, this is a VTC, you know, come join the Discord and we'll help you get settled and started. Um, for sure. But we want more drivers in the VTC. We're actually in the top 150 ATC companies in the world currently. It is only four days into the month. <laughs> um, but yeah, we're trying to get a nice little group together. We will be doing uh, live streams, uh, multiplayer as well. Uh, we will sort that out very, very soon. It is next on my list. Good job ATC is not detecting drunk driving. Yeah, it's very hard to read chat and uh, drive. I wish I was kind of like, you know, a bigger YouTuber that just ignores all you guys for the whole stream. <laughs> That'd be a lot easier. You need a mod that speaks your chat. Yeah, I need something, don't I? I think we have enough fuel and enough rest time to definitely get to our destination. I think we're going to be okay. Is there free mods for American Truck Simulator? Yes, there are free mods. Um, but some of the better mods, like, you know, Coast to Coast, the Mexico map, and stuff like that, you do need all the DLCs to play them. Um, but there are some other freeware mods and stuff on the Steam Workshop that are pretty good. I have quite a few graphical uh, mods on this currently. Um, yeah, there are thousands of free mods. Uh, what's free with Game Pass? Arc. Okay, I don't have Game Pass, so... Ignore the comments whilst people throw money at them. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's what I need. So I'm going to ignore all of you guys to start delivering me, uh, throw some money at me. <laughs> then I'll talk to you. <laughs> you don't have to be a big YouTuber to ignore the chat. Yeah, that's true. That is very true. I should wait till I start hitting ringing for subscribers and uh, super chats. That's what that's what I'll wait for now. <laughs> uh, heaps of free mods and Steam Workshop. Yes. It's a shame because this part of uh, Utah I really like and it's a shame it's night time. What is the Discord? Sorry, I'm new. Uh, no worries mate, uh, the Disco uh, my Discord link will come up in the chat in a couple of minutes if you wait. It, it does post or if you look in the description of any of my videos you'll see the Discord link. Once you come into the Discord make sure you get your role. Uh, it might tell you to wait 10 minutes before you're allowed to do that so don't panic about that. Um, Make sure you get the friend roll and the truck roll and we'll set you up with the ATC. There's plenty of us here that can help you. Blue Ice is the uh, technical expert. Um, you can download the paints, obviously, because we have our own paints. You do need to download Trucks Book. Um, but Hi Highland Homestead, I've actually made a little tutorial on the Trucks Book thing in case you get a little bit stuck. Um, like I said, we do have plenty of people that can help you out in the Discord and we'll get you up on the road and running uh, for us. We do have a full dispatch system like this, you know, I can create jobs for you or you can just pick up your own jobs, depends how you want to play. Um, we have a few rules and bits and pieces there, but look, you'll, uh, you'll pick it up as you go along. It's good fun, I think. Yeah, I don't like that we don't see our speed very well in this truck. Super chats every second. <laughs> okay, thank you for your help. I will join. I will FS join. For sure, join. Okay, yeah, yeah look, mate. And uh, we can all help you out. And uh, yeah, 
and even if you only have the base game with the, the three states there's still plenty to do and like i said there are if you look on like instant gaming you can get new mexico for like two euros um washington oregon is like two or three euros and the steam winter sale also is coming up on the 22nd of december i believe and i'd say it'll, it'll fall pretty cheap again then as well so look there are, there are plenty there mate how long does dispatch jobs last for when you have created them until you've accepted them or declined them so I could give you like 10 jobs now if you want mate and you can do one at a time whenever you want you just accept the one that you're doing uh, but every time you finish a job like now if I create myself another one I have to quit the game accept the next job and reload the game that's the only thing with it but yeah so look uh, like Glenn Glenn Bixley I gave him a load of uh, he's streaming it on the weekend I've given him like five jobs or something like that they don't go away but they stay there so yeah they don't go anywhere. Uh, one thing you hate about York Hospital is the room I was in. It was dirty green. <laughs> uh, I've never been to York Hospital, so... You, you don't want to see hospitals here in Ireland. You think that's dirty? You have no idea. But on the plus side, guys, I've got an orange can today, Glenn, and it's the same size that you guys are normal used to. much at our destination which is good uh no worries mate hope you feel better tomorrow thanks for hanging out as well he's gone for girth over length this time not as adventurous <laughs> <coughs> What the hell? Why am I speeding down this hill? Waking up after being asleep for 12 days to see the room. <laughs> I don't think hospitals are supposed to be nice places. I don't like hospitals. I can barely go in them. It's just that smell. That smell freaks me out. Uh, ATS Gold Edition is about 550 on CD keys. Complete the New Mexico map over the stand ones. Yeah, that's what I mean. So, uh, Highland Homestead, have a little look around. Um, there are definitely, I, I think Instant Gaming was about the same. The Gold Edition, I think it was about six something. <clears throat> I think it's a fun game. It's a relaxing game. I like streaming this. It's just, it obviously looks crap because I can't drive and read the chat. But, you know, normally there's not many people typing, so... Uh, when you have to pay money, you should get something. Well, you should count yourself lucky that you get the NHS. Uh, here, if we go to hospital, doctors, we have to pay. Like, even to go see a GP, we pay 50 euros here. That's not including your medicine that you get for 750. Uh, we have to pay for the, like... So my painkillers at the moment are, like, 40, 50 euros a month just for painkillers. Not including then 50 euros to go see the doctor. I have to pay for scans. That's another 250 euros. You know... We're kind of like America in that sense. Like, our healthcare system is robbery. So, look, I wouldn't complain. At all. <laughs> I think you'd have more luck getting looked after on the NHS as well, to be fair. Yeah, you have to watch Instant Gaming as they seem cheaper than CD keys, but add a tax because you are British. <laughs> yeah, they, they do sometimes, so you, you do have to look around. Like I said, you have to shop around. Yes, we are, and I am in the Republic of Ireland, so yeah, unfortunately, everything is just expensive. But we can't complain, because when you say company, do I hold loads for you? Yes, mate. Uh, I would show you the company skin in a second if, you, if you're still watching when I park this load. But we have repaints, we have skins, we've got everything made uh, for our company. Uh, there's a dispatcher there in the Discord, which is usually me. Uh, you ask for jobs like a real life trucker, and I assign you the jobs. I pick your loads, where you're going, and you have to just drive them, basically. Yeah. So it's like role play in the VTC. There are, like I said, there are set rules. You get a basic truck. You do get to upgrade, but only when I tell you you can upgrade. Uh, you can only buy bases when I tell you you can buy bases and where. Um, 
uh, contracts, like our main contract at the moment is Walbert because we've only really just started this a few weeks ago. So a lot of loads that we pull are for Walbert. But say if I'm not around, you can just pick up loads if you wanted to as well. Um, like you don't have to rely on that. You can do a bit of both. You do have a company trailer, like we did the first load tonight in the company trailer. There just wasn't that many options to where I wanted to go. I wanted to stay in Utah and go across to Colorado. Uh, so that's what we're doing. <clears throat> Unfortunately, not in the Mac. I might have to go and get the Mac. So we might go back up to Eugene on the next video. Um, I see how I feel about that. Might take this for a couple more spins yet, but uh, definitely want to get get the Mac going. When they gave me a, the jab, they rammed it in my arm. <laughs> yeah, sounds about right. Oh, for God's sake. I was just slowing down. Anyways, welcome to Mope. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but welcome. We are going to go past something here. I say it's going to be an agency. Recruitment agency there on this side. Still speeding. Uh, before we take this load anywhere else, we are going to stop for fuel because it's on the way. Fill the tanks. <laughs> I suppose they do get paid to do the job that they do. I wouldn't like doing that to people all day long. Okay. Get back on the road. Busiest road in America. like making people suffer yeah maybe you have to be that kind of person to do that job i don't know <clears throat> i wouldn't enjoy that now myself i don't think i could be jabbing people all day and taking blood and i'm not screamish it's just uh, it just no it's just not not my cup of tea imagine doing that all day uh, fair play to them though like full respect to the people that do this stuff for us obviously but uh Pretty rough. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the smell of hospitals either, to be fair. Makes me feel weird. Okay, goods and stuff, here we are. Too bad. Okay, so Highland Homestead, if you're still there, uh, you're gonna see. Oh, what a plonker! Bet he caught myself on the gate. 
that's the problem with having no mirrors. That's why I like the the Mac. So, uh, Homestead, as I was saying, here we go. Here is our company trucks, here is our repaints. Uh, simply connect haulage. Here you go. So, yeah, you'll get all of this stuff when you join. Okay, let's get this truck put away. Bloody went the wrong way. Obviously, you guys don't have to park it in the hardest spots. I just think it's worth it for the extra points. <laughs> then doesn't have to be perfect uh taking the trailer damage out of your wages yeah <laughs> they're gonna they're gonna find me now oh they didn't oh for sure that's all right okay guys so look i'm gonna call it a day there um quite happy with that unless there's something really short shall we have a look at something really short We're in the middle of nowhere. Oh, 21 grand though. That is by length. That is the shortest job that they have. This is why I like creating my own jobs. Oh, wow. 58 grand. Maybe we should do that for the next stream. All the way from Utah, Idaho, Oregon, up to Washington. Yeah, maybe this is what we're going to do. Nice parking. Yeah. Cheers, mate. <laughs> Wasn't great. But it'll do. Okay, so yeah, look, guys, that's why I'm going to call it a day here for tonight. Um, but look, there we go. There's the new truck in the company. If any of you guys want to come join the VTC, you are more than welcome. Um, We'll do some sort of long haulage for the next one. I said I might just accept that job so it's ready for the next stream. I didn't want to go over this way though. Uh, I don't know. I'll have a think about it. So after that, oh, we're going to head over uh, to Colorado. Then maybe make our way back down and around. Back to Vegas. Or we can go back to the Mac that's over here. Uh, yeah, not, not, not entirely sure. I'll have a think about it um richard cheers mate thank you means a lot much appreciate hey fellas on the next stream we should throw down the challenge donations for the boss i don't know how about you but i'd pay to see a full figure eight reverse into a loading bay <laughs> sure i'll do that why not <laughs> I, I generally park better than that tonight was the worst parking i've done in a long time don't know what's wrong with me maybe i'm tired <laughs> amen <laughs> yeah we'll see we'll see what happens <laughs> Good stream. I'm going to fix that logo position for the hood mirrors later, fellas. No worries, mate. Uh, no worries, everyone. Hello. And always, thank you very much for hanging out. All you guys, as usual, Kat is hard. Richard, Lucas, uh, Living Fusion, Spaghetti Raver, um, Glenn B. I know you're there. And everybody else, of course. Artful. Uh, Highland Homestead, if you have joined the Discord, I'll, I'll find out now in a minute. Blue Ice Gaming, you can go back to your pizza making. Uh, yeah. Awesome, 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 awesome. 
Tomorrow, I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. Tomorrow, I'll be, uh, I'll be live streaming tomorrow. There'll be nothing on Saturday. Um, so, I don't know what we're going to do tomorrow. What would you guys like to see quickly? Planes, trains, or something completely random? <laughs> People keep asking me to make City Skyline videos. I don't know, I don't know about that. What would we like to see? Do you want to see some planes tomorrow? I don't know about Microsoft Flight Simulator though because they just, I don't know, they're working. Sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. Maybe we we'll do a Microsoft Flight Simulator, A320 maybe. Um, yeah, let me know. Well, let me know in the Discord what you guys might like to see. Um, Artful, Firefighter Sim. A random. Yeah, we could do Firefighter Sim. I've got, I've got no hassles with that. Whatever you guys want to do. I don't want to be the host though, because obviously we seem to be having issues when I host. So someone else will have to host. All right, so we'll leave that there. Maybe I'll put up a little thing uh, on the, uh, the community tab on YouTube. So keep an eye out for that. You can have a vote on that maybe. Um, but other than that, guys, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.